What's up guys, this is Grandma Mayo here, and I'm bringing you a tutorial on noise gate for OBS. Uh, how many people asked about it, wanted to know how to use it, etc, etc. Uh, I made it a small little window, I don't know if you guys can see it, hopefully you guys can, but first off, if uh, what a noise gate does is it reduces the background noise um, for like streaming, recording, all that stuff. You want to use it to take hisses out and... Uh, pe maybe people screaming far back in the distance and you know, it'll pretty much just pick up uh, Like your voice close up to the mic unless you have something going on in your room or wherever you're recording But if you listen the f next like two three seconds You'll hear it completely drops out. My mic will just stop saying anything. That's the noise gate. So here we go And you can hear it didn't pick anything up that's because I have a noise gate on. So to do this, you want to go up to settings, go back to settings, and then go down to micro microphone noise gate. Let me see if you guys can see this, hopefully. It's microphone noise gate right here. Um, when you get in here, leave all this here. Leave the 25, 200, and 150. Uh, 25 attack time, 200 hold time, 150 release time. Make sure you enable the noise gate. Make sure that's checked and i don't oh yeah uh enable the preview too if it's not enabled um so pretty much as you can tell this green bar that goes up and down right here this is for your uh, volume voice this is your voice volume i mean sorry um you want to have this a little bit above your green bar see right here is the background noise so you want to set that up just a little bit. I'd just leave mine as default for what it was set as. And um, it's kind of hard to explain this, but the open threshold, you want to put that 4 up from 32. So mine's set at negative 28 dB. And that'll pretty much open up whenever, there's, uh, whenever it needs to open up and get rid of all the background noise. Don't keep it as a default where it's like it's... Uh, opens up like negative 7 or negative 10 dB or something like that and I see people saying negative 10 and for me it just screwed it all up and it wouldn't work right so I set mine at negative 4 dB above of uh, what I or below I, what I got this right here and it works perfectly fine so this should help you out um, yeah I just leave everything as default like I try to get it pretty much as close as I can to the green bar fluctuating right here that's all background noise from right here all the way down is background noise, see? So I usually try to raise it about, you know, like 4 dB or so above the green bar. That's what I do. I don't know if this is default. I can't remember. But, uh, yeah, that's how you set the noise gate. And I hope this helped you guys out. Let me know if it works. If not, toy around with it. Use those settings and just find out what works best for you because it's not always going to be the same. All right, guys. Have a good one.